Carve your name into the sun Love you till my days are done I'll never let them go You're the fire inside my blood Burn the bad and leave the good My angel, I'm your ghost I'm never Look at you. Stop it. <laughs> you stop. Oh, you're so handsome. Love you. Love you. My little girl. You look so handsome. Some days we'll win wild hearts until the end. We'll never let them go. Even when I'm on your nerves, you love me more than I deserve. We are gathered here in the presence of God, family, and friends to unite Spencer and Samantha in holy matrimony. Marriage is an honorable estate and is therefore not to be entered into lightly, but reverently and advisedly and with God's blessing. Today they will receive God's greatest gift, another person to share with, grow with, change with, be joyful with, and to stand as one when trials and tribulations enter their lives. Marriage is a joyous occasion. It is connected in our thoughts with the charm of love, the warmth of home, and with all that is pleasant as being one of the most important events in our lives. Its sacredness and unity is the most significant and binding covenant known in the human relation. Spencer and Samantha, let me charge you both to remember that your future happiness is to be a mutual consideration, patience, kindness, confidence, and affection. It is the duty of each of you to find your greatest joy in the company of the other. To remember that your love pledged today must remain undivided for a lifetime. The Bible tells us in Jeremiah, love yesterday, today, and forever. You will now exchange vows. These vows are a lifelong commitment to one another. Each of us here today are the witnesses who will help them to honor these vows. I, Spencer, take you, Samantha. I, Spencer, take you, Samantha. To be my lawfully wedded wife. To be my lawfully wedded wife. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. From this day forward. From this day forward. For better or worse. For better or worse. For richer or for poorer. For richer or for poorer. And sickness and in health. And sickness and in health. To love and to cherish for as long as we both shall live. To love and to cherish for as long as we both shall live. Now, Samantha, 
Please repeat after me. I, Samantha, take you, Spencer. I, Samantha, take you, Spencer. To be my husband. To be my husband. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. From this day forward. From this day forward. For better or for worse. For better or for worse. For richer or for poorer. For richer or for poorer. <laughs> and sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. To love and to cherish. To love and to cherish. For as long as we both shall live. For as long as we both shall live. You will now exchange rings mm -hmm. as a symbol of the lifelong commitment you as husband and wife have just promised to each other. The rings are on their way. <laughs> Cue set. Yeah, they're still at the store. <laughs> Somebody run to Walmart. Roll tape. <laughs> Spencer, please place the ring on Samantha's finger and repeat after me. I give you this ring as a sign of my love and faithfulness. I give you this ring as a sign of my love and faithfulness. Samantha, please place the ring on Spencer's finger and repeat after me. I give you this ring as a sign of my love and faithfulness. I give you this ring as a sign of my love and faithfulness. All good things are worth waiting for. I will leave you with a scripture from Romans. Be devoted to one another in love and honor one another above yourselves. Spencer and Samantha, having witnessed your vows for marriage before God and who all are assembled here today, by the authority vested in me, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Spencer, you may kiss your beautiful bride. Like a needle that went straight into my veins.